Good morning, my peeps. Good morning, and I love you. Happy Sunday, Sunday. Getting ready to head over to church, waiting on Allie, of course, um, to worship our Lord, our Savior, our King, Jesus Christ. And, um, you know, my heart is a bit burdened. It's been for the past few days. You know, I've got friends going through stuff. I've got my own stuff, you know, family stuff. And um, But the big thing that's weighing on me is I just found out... Uh, last week that an ex-boyfriend of mine has passed away and um, we dated for a little over a year and um, one of the funniest guys I've ever known in my life probably the funniest guy I've known personally in my life he can make you cry laughing he just what a gift he had and um, I, I think that drugs were the cause obviously I'm not close to that family anymore um, but it's a safe bet and uh, my heart is burdened. I don't know what his spiritual state was and um, as a believer I, I can't you know cut and dice the Bible to suit my emotion. It is what it is so I'm gonna enter the throne room this morning with just pleading for God's endless mercy and grace for Brian's soul and for his family and for his friends including myself that are just so overwhelmed with just sadness I mean that's the only word it's it's such a small word to kind of address what I'm feeling but anyway guys uh, I think it's safe to tell you that his name is Brian you know obviously I want to keep privacy at the utmost so just lift a prayer for him his family his friends and let's just take it to the throne room this morning and lift him up in praise and worship I'll talk to you in a little bit Look at that guys, it's really coming together now. Just gotta get those side doors done. Oh, I can't wait. I think everybody's eager for it to finally open up. We're so squished. Totally uninspired. <laughs> but Allie saw these at Publix after church and she said, oh, you know, I've been waiting for these to come out. So I told her if she cooks them, we can have this for a lunchtime snack. And then we'll come up with something for dinner. I did buy some of those frozen Purdue chicken tenders and nuggets. Just in case I'm still uninspired. You know, just to have something on the back burner. But I'm just going to lay down for a little while and, uh, and rest. And then I'll just see, you know, how I feel in a couple hours. Oop, oven is preheated. Time to throw them in there. So this is what happens when I'm uninspired, people. McDonald's time. <laughs> Glenn went and got it for us. So this is going to be dinner. And with that, I'm going to say goodnight. I'll see y'all in the morning. Bye.